Hello guys, you are welcome to the Blanche Ingram TV show. If you are new on this channel, please don't forget to subscribe, like and share my videos. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell so anytime I upload a video, you will receive notification. And to my return subscribers, I love you guys believe social media at your own risk believe social media at your own risk cora obedi and justin dean just made us to realize that most often people come on social media and do drama and do what we call drama they have made us to believe that most often, what you see on social media is not what goes on in your real life. It is only after the birth of their second child that so many things unfolded that what they were doing on social media wasn't the life they were living. So, for those who don't know Cora Obidi, Cora Obidi is resident in U.S. and originally from Nigeria. She got married to this doctor called uh, uh, Justin Dean, and they have two children together. The first child it will be clocking four years soon, and the second child is barely a year. And during the during all this why. Uh, Justin Dean and Cora Obedi have made us believe that marriage is the best thing that can ever happen to two people. Because the way they, like I can say they won the social media platform. They were everywhere on social media showing love for each other, loving each other. These two people can do everything anywhere. Like they can do anything anywhere when it comes to love. Kissing everywhere and just they were all over each other. But it is only after the birth of their second child that we realize that all what Cora, Obedi and Justin Dean were doing was merely drama, what we call drama. Cora Obedi came out the other day to cry to the entire, entire world that her husband, Justin Dean, or her ex-husband, Justin Dean, wants to seize her children from her. He wants to take her children from her, which Cora Obedi doesn't want to give her kids to the man. Justin Zinn has been filing complaints to the court which uh, could permit him take the children from Cora. And Cora, on the other side, don't want to give her kid to Justin Dean because according to Cora, Justin Dean can't take care of the kid as she does. In her video, Cora says that whenever the kids visit Justin Zinn, they either come back sick or the, the youngest comes back with heat rashes and heat rashes and rashes all over her bum bum because her diapers or her diaper was, uh, 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 was not changed for more than 24 hours. First, on this complaint, it was said that Cora abandoned her child in the room and was on Facebook doing 
make up. Secondly, Justin Dean says on the complaint that Coral abandons the children for 20 minutes to go pick up her sister. And Cora explains that her sister came from Nigeria and she had to go uh, just nearby, maybe downstairs, to pick up her sister. And she didn't abandon the child because the, her neighbor was in the house and the child was sleeping. So to, according to Cora, she doesn't see that as a reason why doc, Dr. Uh, uh, Dean, she doesn't see that as any reason why Dr. Dean would want to take her kid away from her. Still on the complaint that Justin Dean wrote against Cora, he said Cora's sister threatened to kill him if he got out of the car. And Cora's brother-in-law was so frightful that he was afraid that this man could hurt him. And to Coral, this is all drama because these people are people whom he has actually met. They have actually had nice time together. So he do she doesn't know why Dr. Dean or Justin Dean is making stories with all these things. And Cora is so angry with this because the way Dr. Dean puts all this complaint is as if she is not supposed to have a life of her own again. It's as if she is not supposed to do anything of her own, anything concerning her personal self she's not supposed to cater for. It's only the kids, the kids, and the kids. And of course, it's no big deal to Cora because she says she lost her kid and she's ready to sacrifice for her kids. But she's very mad about the complaints that, Doc, that Justin Dean gives. Why? Because according to Cora, she is uh, the best mom. It is true that she has her own shortcomings, but these things can happen to any other mother or to any other child. She says that Dr. Dean, who is complaining today, is equally having his own shortcomings as far as being a father is concerned. As she states that last time when Dr. Dean was with the children and was online. Her eldest daughter, or their eldest daughter, who is called June, came on that live show with a syringe in her hand. And according to Cora, this syringe is, must have been used by Dr. Dean or Justin Dean to inject some sort of uh, um, some some sort of drugs in him, and she says that had it been this child hurt the younger sister with this syringe or hurt even her own self with this syringe, the case wouldn't have been the same. So and for Justin Dean to have used a syringe and kept it carelessly, knowing fully well that he has young children in the house, was so, so poor. So those are the instances where Cora brings in to tell the world that she, she might not be perfect, but Justin Dean is not equally a perfect father. So why is Justin Dean making a story out of all what is happening with her and her children. But what caught my attention in this video that Cora did is the fact that Cora came out to say certain things that her husband used to do to her when they were still married. Considering the fact that they were always very happy on social media. They were always playing online, kissing each other online, being all over each other online. I, I'm like, is this for real? 
Cora said, Justine didn't used to abuse her physically, like beat her up, slaps her, give her bruises on her skin. And then my memory was failing me because of all this social media. And then I, dre I, 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 I hallucinated the slap. If I'm lying to you, let me fall down and die here if truly these things were happening in their home and Cora was covering it up painting it painting her home a perfect home then I will say I clap for ladies ladies can cover things up for Africa like seriously so my worry is this the reasons why Dr. Zin wants to collect wants the court to collect or to take his children away from Cora, who is their mom, reasonable enough. First, he says Cora leaves the child for 20 minutes to pick the, 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 the sister downstairs, and Cora supports that. He, she didn't leave the child because the neighbor was in her house, and she just rush for some minutes to pick her sister, which is reasonable enough. Secondly, Justin Dean says, Cora is on live video uh, doing live stream while allowing the children unattended to. Thirdly, Justin Dean says, Cora's sister threatened his life and Cora's brother-in-law was so frightful to him. Cora uh leaves the children behind and is doing makeup on social media or on facebook these are the reasons fired by justin dean are there enough reason to seize a lady's child from her or to take away a lady's child i don't know i leave this to the comment section you can put your comments below. Tell me what you think about this. So watch this. She left her apartment to go get her sister in another complex. And videotaped the whole thing. Athena was asleep. I have my neighbor, Lauren. She's right there. She was here. I picked my sister up. So I cannot go down and pick anybody up. I cannot come out of the house. And this is life. This is what life is, right? I cannot, if I pick up myself and come out of the house, even if I have Lauren sitting right there, I cannot move as a mother in America. It's, it's, it's against the law for me to move as a mother in America. Please, mothers in America, help me. Is it against the law for me to have my neighbor here, my child sleeping in the room and go pick my sister up downstairs? Or she should, she should stay outside. She should stay outside after coming all the way from Nigeria because I cannot pick her up. Is this, is this against the law? Please, mothers in America, help me. Let me know. If, if I... you come across this video, don't forget to subscribe, like and share. Leave your comments below. Tell me what you think about Justin Dean and Cora and the children. If actually Cora is neglecting her children or not, let me know in the comment section. See you. Bye-bye.